Buongiorno a tutti e benvenuti in questo nuovo video Oggi volevo portare sul canale Life is Strange Lo so che non è un nuovo gioco Però mi piace moltissimo perché ho sempre visto tutti eh, i video degli youtubers E Klaus abbaia Mi è sempre piaciuto molto questo gioco Quindi volevo portarlo sul canale Sigla e via E continui questo video gioco, sono probabilmente fittizia, non intendo rappresentare schiena bla 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 bla. Importante avventezza per le rose bla 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 bla. Questo gioco salva automaticamente quando appare questo simbolo non spegnere la console Xbox One. Life is strange. Sono antinisca. Facciamo il salvataggio 2, così siamo sicuri che nessuno ce lo tocca. Selezioniamo. Nuova partita. Life is Strange è un'avventura narrativa influenzata dalle scelte del giocatore. Le conseguenze delle azioni e delle decisioni avranno effetto sul passato, sul presente e sul futuro. Scegli con cautela. Ansia però. Perché partiamo già bene. Ok, tocca a noi, andiamo. Dobbiamo raggiungere il faro. Era un sogno. That was so surreal. called film Little Pieces of Time. But he could be talking about photography as he likely was. Okay. I'm in class. Everything's cool. I am okay. From light to shadow. From color to chiaroscuro. Now, can you give me an example of a photographer who perfectly captured the human condition in black and white? I didn't fall asleep, and that sure didn't feel like a dream. Bueller? Weird. Diane Arbus. There you go, Victoria. Why Arbus? Because of her images of hopeless faces. You feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers. Look at this crap. How can I show this to Mr. Jefferson? I can hear the class laughing at me now. She saw humanity as tortured, right? And frankly, it's bullshit. Shh, 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 shh. Keep that to yourself. Seriously, though, I could frame any one of you. Shh, shh, shh. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. Of course, as you all know, the photo portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. Your generation was not the first to use images for selfie expression. Sorry, I couldn't resist. The point remains that the portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please Tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits. 
Conoscendomi io farei lo sta chiedendo a me. You're asking me? L let me think. Um. You either know this or not, Max. Is sì, vabbè, dammi il tempo di pensare. Louis Daguerre was a French painter who created daguerreotypes, a process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Very good, Victoria. The Daguerrean process brought out fine detail in people's faces. Making them... If anybody else looked at this, what would they think? I'm extremely popular from the 1800s onward. The first American daguerreotype self-portrait was done by Robert Cornelius. Look at this crap. How can I show this to Mr. Jefferson? I can hear the class laughing at me now. Guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure, and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry, too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Possiamo andarci. Finalmente. Victoria doesn't waste a second kissing ass. Huh. This might make a cool shot. I know, Mr. Jefferson. Work. I just really think Everyday Heroes is an important cultural event. And I want to represent Blackwell Academy. You have just by participating. By putting yourself out there in the world. Now, no matter who wins, this is just a bump on a... I see you, Max Caulfield. Don't even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. Devo proprio o non ho avuto tempo? Devo proprio. Do I have to? I just don't think it's that big a deal. Max, you're a better photographer than a liar. Now, I know it's a drag to hear some old dude lecture you. But life won't wait for you to play catch up. You're young, the world is yours, blah, 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 right? But you do have a gift. You have the fever to take images, to frame the world only the way you envision it. Now, all you need is the courage to share your gift with others. And that's what separates the artist from the amateur. Come profondo il mio professore. This is ridiculous. I always get so shy and nervous around Mr. Jefferson. Every time I look at Victoria, I feel like she's talking smack about me. Man, he even has the best plasma HDTV for a class monitor. I can't wait to watch some more documentaries. You didn't tell me how cute I looked yet. I was about to. I'm not paying on you. Always Welcome to the cute. real world. Just cute. Hot. Then I might send you a special picture at Science Lab. They're just getting you ready because Max wants everybody to see how hip she is. He plays it so shy. I need a serious time out in the bathroom. Splash water on my face and make sure I don't look like a total loser. I hate that class, it's so fucking boring. Il primo episodio è finito. Io vi mando un bacio grande. Mi raccomando, se vi è piaciuto il video lasciate un like, commentate, condividete e iscrivetevi al canale.